Eli 5. Why are larger house car rechargeable batteries specified in KWH, but smaller batteries, laptop, smartphone are specified in MA? I get that. For a house solar battery, it sort of makes sense, as your typical energy usage would be measured in KWH on your bills. For the smaller devices, though, the chargers are usually rated in watts, especially if it's USB-C. So why are the batteries specified in amp hours by the manufacturers? The answer. Tradition of using MA for one, and progress of using proper unit of energy for the other. Also, lying to customers. MA is not a unit of battery capacity. If you see a battery with 200 MA and another battery with 300 MA, this is not enough information to say which one has bigger capacity. To get the capacity from MA, you need to multiply it by the voltage. A 200 MA battery with 10 volts output has capacity of star 10 equals 2000 MWH. A 300 MA battery with 5 volts output has capacity of star 5 equals 1500 MWH. If you compare batteries of same type, same voltage, then MA is enough to compare them with, but in general it is useless number on its own. For cheap electronics, a big part is also using this nonsense to lie to the consumer because it allows listing big numbers for the product that do not mean anything. So if any product that is not just a bare battery lists its capacity in MA, you can usually completely disregard that number as worthless marketing blubber. For example, a quick check on battery bank listings on a single shop, I found these two. Product 1. Advertised as 30,000 ma. Actual capacity 111 WH. Product 2. Advertised as 26,000 ma. Actual capacity 288 WH. Many products that do not list their WH capacity at all. For general batteries, the voltages can be whatever depending on the battery construction and there may be circuits to step the voltage up or down. So using real unit of capacity is the only proper way to label them. Follow this channel for more Santa Explains.